you want to think of the stomach as kind of a balloon. As it kind of empties out, sometimes you'll hear that sloshing. So why does our stomach growl when we're hungry, or why do we hear those rumblings in our belly? Um, so basically what we're hearing is the motion of the muscles that contract in our digestive system, which includes the stomach, the small bowel, and the colon. And what you're kind of hearing is the sloshing around of the fluids, a little bit of the air passing by as well. And when your stomach is empty, or if your small bowel is empty, there's no food in there or anything to buffer the sound, so it sounds a little bit louder. As far as your stomach shrinking, it's not necessarily shrinking. I like to call it as more of a deflating. Uh, but it usually doesn't make a noise per se. If you want to think of the stomach as kind of a balloon, in its resting state it's like a floppy balloon. And when it gets filled with water, air, gas, food, then it just kind of keeps expanding. But as it kind of empties out, sometimes you'll hear that sloshing, sometimes you'll hear kind of the passing of the gas from as it passes from the stomach into the small bowel. The growling is just more the basically just the motion of everything sloshing around in there. Because you're empty or because the stomach is empty, there's no food in there to buffer the sounds. So it's, it seems like they're louder. Those sounds that we hear in the digestive tract um, as physicians are very important because then there's normal bowel sounds that we like to listen to in normal healthy people. But if people are critically ill, those changes in the bowel sounds make a big deal of difference. And we're able to diagnose obstruction and any other medical problem um, that might be causing those changes in the, in the gastrointestinal sounds.